This morning, I listened to the Nigerian Association of Resident Doctors on television. And I think we can marry part of their demands with our discussions here. They made it known that on May 19, 2023, which is this year, they signed an MOU with federal government after meeting with the Senate and House of Rep Committee on health. And that within that period and now, nothing has come out of the MOU. So I want to, I want to add that we make appeal to them to resume work and possibly work on how the agreement reach as contained in the MOU could be settled within them. They made known of three demands, sir. That the request for one for one replacement policy for healthcare workers, that's a policy. That they want immediate payment of all salaries, areas. Uh, it is therefore very, very important. Very, very, very important. I will do all within our powers to make them come back to work. Because if we don't do that, then we all know that health is life, then they won't be life. Or our lives will be in great jeopardy. So I align myself with the, all that is said in this motion. I align myself to the intendment of this motion because it's very, very, very important that we get our doctors back to work. Otherwise, we'll be in problem. It is said over and over again that as we speak, there's a disease outbreak in some parts of this country. Now, do we now add salt to an open injury? No, we wouldn't do that. The resolutions of the Senate as met today will be implemented with seriousness and also taken into consideration in the ongoing uh, strike. We also hope that the resident doctors will listen to the plea of the Nigerian Senate as met today uh, to end this strike, particularly taking cognizance of the humanitarian uh, uh, aspect of it, the number of lives that are lost, is their, their provision is generally to save lives, not to lose lives. So we from the Senate are appealing to them that yes, while the ongoing negotiations uh, are, are being made, that they should consider and um, suspend this strike in the humanitarian interest for the benefit of all Nigerians, even for the benefit of their families.